Yeah, he's looking in the bag thinking it's gonna be cracking, it's like an N64. <laughs> dude, fuck, yeah, dude, the old cracking guy, just like, he peeks in the bag and shit, dude. And was, then he asked me for some other shit, I don't even know what he was like saying, I was like, no, I, I don't have any, man. <laughs> I just like got my Jeep and this just drove over to the other guy and then he like Tell filled out left. Pissing around and get this big guy back huh. into action. So weird, dude. And yeah. I told the guy, the real dude, like he probably thought I was trying to rip him off or something. I don't know. He probably got some weird vibe, man, because I was like all jittery and shaking almost. I was kind of shooken up, you know. I was like, I told him, I was like, yeah, dude, I just had some crack. I got like trying to bump money. I thought he was like you or something. Dude. Yeah. And then I told him, uh, I asked, him, I was like, yeah, do you play online? And he was like, yeah. And I was just like, yeah, well, I play, I play that stuff online. And he was like, that? And I was like, yeah. I was like, yeah, we. He was like, yeah, I got emulators on my phone, but I, I never knew you could play that online. And he was like, what do you play on, like, what kind of games? Like, which ones do you play online? I was like, yeah, like, Goldeneye. He was like, what, really? Like, he was all surprised about it, and I was like, yeah, look up, uh, retro online multiplayer on YouTube. There's, like, Discord links and shit, man. You can join the group, and there's people that play and shit. Yeah. He tried to promote, you know? Huh. He was a pretty cool guy. I just, I didn't even, I didn't test the, uh, I didn't test the console out, because I'm pretty sure that it fucking works. Like, it always work so it should be anything wrong but I think I'm gonna hang on to dude's money in case it somehow doesn't work I'd feel bad for just ripping the guy off you know so uh, do you, did you sell the 964? yeah I have two of them I sold one I sold the regular looking one I didn't get many controllers I just sold the console the power cord and the RCA cord for how much did you sell for? 45 bucks. That's no not control. bad, though. Yeah, I know. They're yeah, usually yeah, like 50, right? <clears throat> I mean, yeah, but that's on Craigslist. I, I mean, on uh, eBay. Yeah, exactly. So. Yeah, so that's about right. But, you know, there was a, you know, I had the fucking top of the expansion pack thing wasn't on there, you know what I mean? Like, they had the normal expansion pack thing, the one that's not the expansion pack, you know what I mean? It yeah. didn't have the, the little lid that clamps onto it, the whole Yeah. And I told him, I was just like, yeah, man, I, I was just going to do like a mod with it, but I figured I'd be, you know, better off selling it, because I'd probably fuck it up. But I told him, I was like, I, was like I, got a, I got an orange one that I use at home, and I really don't even use them, you know what I mean? So, it's for the wrong shit. But he was like telling me that he plays the, the games on his phone and shit. Obviously not online, but the phone emulation kind of sucks unless you get a really good phone. Yeah, touch the yeah, touch screen controls are trash. But you could get those little Bluetooth controllers. Yeah. But there is uh, there is input delay, I think, on some of those. Yeah. Oh. But they're pretty nice. Oh, cool. Man, it's all weird. Man, it's all shook up. Still, just... try to avoid things like that. You know what I mean? But it just happened anyway. Like, I felt like one of those pranksters on YouTube. Like when I walked up to the old dude that thought he's I was like waving to get... you off. Yeah. He like waved me off like I was some some. Uh, Guy loitering in a fucking yeah, like I was trying to bump money off of, or I had drugs, or I was trying to make a deal. Sell them, they all die. So bread. weird, dude. Yeah. I, s I thought that was him, cause the guy like pulled up in front of me, like on the other side of like the parking lot, kind of not too far away, but like right where I could see him. And he opens his door and then he shuts it, and then he pulls around and parks on this other spot. And I'm like, well, maybe he's trying to signal that that's him. So I almost walked up to that guy at first. You know? Yeah. The funniest part was the crackhead guy like peeking in the bag like to me like that was hilarious. Huh. Yo, what you got? It was crazy. I was like thinking in my head. I was like, man, I should probably get on like Discord and like you know, yeah. turn my camera on and shit. I should have done that. <laughs> you guys would have fucking laughed. The crackhead guy was just crazy. Yeah, but after 12 the way he pulled up, dude, I like nodded at him. I was like, oh, it's you, yeah. <laughs> like I get out of the car, he's like nodding at me like, yeah. You know, like we were like. Me, bro. Like I fucking thought it was him, and I was like, dude. After that happened, I was like, did I just get set up? Like, this guy just hit me up to put my money off. What the fuck's going on, dude? Yo, check this out. But then I was like thinking in my head, I was like, dude, there's no way that that guy could even text a message like the guy that was texting. Like, yeah. You could tell it was like some normal like white kid and shit. Dude, we were in fucking Twilight Zone, really. Fucking weird, man. Like, I've done a Craigslist deal, like, one time, and it was normal. Like, I just met this old redneck guy in a parking lot, gave him this case knife, he handed me $20. That was it. You know? Yeah. And that time, man, I had, like, three fucking moments, like, within five minutes, dude. So weird. I felt like Steve when the old guy, like, left and, like, 
waved me off and shit. I was just like, I kind of like laughed about it though. I was like, dude, that's pretty fucking funny, man. Like, I wonder what that guy was thinking. No, I didn't even really feel like Steve, but I just felt like really awkward. Like, I felt like a YouTube prankster, like one of those guys that like walks up and touches somebody's hand for like no reason or something. Like, I just felt like that guy. Like, wow. It was just fucking hilarious, dude. I think I'm gonna hold on to that guy's money in case he's like, oh, it don't work or something. All right, all right, man, meet me, give me the thing back, and I'll give you your money back. I'm not sketchy like that. See you at the party. And I live like right here, so. So what consoles are you down to now? No N64. Oh no, wait, you said you got two of them. No, I, I had two of them. I got, I sold him that one. Yeah. So now I just got the orange one, which is cool with me. That's all I need. Yeah. I got the tool to take it apart and clean it, so there's nothing. Oh, what did in you order have for? To... It... What? I forgot. Equinox. What? You're like, oh shit, I forgot to do something really important, and then you just left. Yeah, I, I had to, uh, I have to line up jobs. I got a bunch of jobs in. Like, I forgot I even, had, uh, I have nothing lined up for tomorrow. Nothing. <laughs> for like the next yeah. week. You admit you lost that whole day, didn't you? Is that why? Um. You lost the whole day of productivity, really being locked out. Trash. Yeah, no, yeah, kind of. It was kind of a setback, but I don't know. Maybe the customers wouldn't be able to schedule tomorrow anyway. So. Mm. Yeah, know. things happen. Just the day. It's just, I hate leaving those guys out of work, though, you know? Yeah. Because then they start working no, for man, other people. Yeah, good anyway. I mean, shit, one day ain't gonna really kill them. Nah, dude, it's like, I, I mean, I don't have anything lined up for like a week. Mm. Damn. Like, they just, like, I, I really let the paperwork get backed up. Like, I, I just submitted like 17 jobs all at once. And they don't, they don't give new jobs until I, you know, submit completed the completed paperwork for all the jobs. <laughs> So I should be getting 17 okay. jobs in, but now there's this gap in the schedule. <laughs> hey, so weird. What's up? Still feel nervous and shit. We interrupt this broadcast for a special news bulletin. Eyewitnesses have confirmed that several aliens have descended from the mothership and uh, uh, are now reportedly in line at the Duke Burger on the Vegas Strip. No oh, at least you got her done. Yeah. Yeah. I just leave, like, I'm here, you know, like, he just left. <laughs> Why did he wave? Uh, Fucking weird, man. Should have known the old guy doesn't like no 64, bro. Really. Well, he, he was like, you know, in his 50s, you know, I, I'd be, you'd be surprised. Old people fucking play yeah, video games sometimes. Maybe he was getting it for his son or something. Yeah, the old school shit. There's old dudes that fucking collect that shit. So I was like, maybe it's him. But then I was like thinking the same thing. I was like, dude, this guy's like so old. You sign this for me? You know, like. Sure, kid. But I better not find this on eBay. This is funny that he like waved me off. Yeah. Such a weird feeling. I was just like. Yeah, but you know, Steve would get all pissed off. You know, that's something. I was like laughing about it. I was like still kind of like in shock. You know, like. Okay, I just got some cracker guy like almost mugged me right there. Hmm. And then this old dude's just like freaking out. Now nah, what am I gonna do? Like, hmm. and I looked at my phone and the guy's like, I'm pulling in. I want to go up to uh, like, I seen him. Take your him do like a U-turn and then he came towards me. I was like, all right, cool. This is like some like college-looking kid, kind of like nerdy looking. Wow. Thank you, Mr. Newcomb. Yeah, I was gonna say. No normal looking guy though. He's not looking really. He did have like a phone. Yeah, I have my phone turned on. So. Looking good, dude. I had dated. Shit. That's why I could have got on the call. I should have gotten the call, man. It's really great, Jake. Mm -hmm. and then, I'm really happy. I'm really happy for you, Jake. Mm -hmm. It's feel weird. Man. Ah, sorry, Duke. Looks like they're shutting us down for the night. Yeah. On some nah. days, all I hear is Johnny, 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 but a couple of those aliens come down and suddenly it's all news, all channels. Half the damn crew is left to see what they're up to at Duke Burger. I kind of wonder if they timed it with you coming on the show and all. I gotta find out what the hell is going on around here. Na na na. Come get some. <laughs> I'll hook you up with my assistant to reschedule. She'll take care of you. I promise. 
Guess you can't wait for those Duke Burger cell phone pics to hit the Yeah, I just hit up. that Sicilian no chick on here. Right? I just sent her a message. I said, on console, and she says, yes, Xbox One. I said, get PC. Laugh out loud. And she says, she says, uh, yeah, let me shit thousands of dollars. Just like laughed at it. Yeah, no kidding. I just bought the power supply and the fan, so now I have to buy the rest of it. Faster if she plays Apex. So. Uh, it's like a cross platform there, brother. Yeah. Rolling in them little Xbox parties, man. Shut it. Uh, I kind of regret buying that stuff. What stuff? Why? Oh, the computer stuff? Yeah. Why would happen? I was shocked that you actually did that. I didn't think we would actually get. I know. I just been looking at it for so long that I finally just like. Wrong with buying it. Yeah, dude, buy that shit. Yeah, buy it. You're right. Why not? Yeah, hurry up and get that computer. Goddamn it! Shit keeps crashing. Right now. So, at least you get some form of. I don't care. I need people to play games with me. I'll pay it. Pay the. Not the struggle a little bit, but who cares? I mean, it'll pretty much be worth it. Yeah, get out there and get that computer so you can play games with me, goddammit. That's a good price though, that six hundred that the power source for sixty bucks. Mm -hmm. I yeah. mine I just I had to upgrade mine. Mine six like six hundred fifty watts. And it, it was like ninety dollars. Damn, it's that's just, American too. Yeah. So oh yeah, American maybe it balances currency. out. Yeah, I forget what oh my God. I forgot. Yeah, Canadian probably yeah. Yeah. uh yeah. 80. That makes me feel good about it then. Yeah, the prices I ha currently have lined up here are some of the best. Just waiting for motherboard prices to come down right now. They like went up. There was lots of good deals and I waited too long. I fudged the bucket. But I didn't want to buy anything because I was scared. Hindus don't like spending money, brother. No, 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 no. Yeah, I feel like I'm even getting more uh, conservative as time goes on, man. It's yeah, you get older. Not a bad idea. My grandpa's like. They like that, man. And he had a lot of money. Yeah. He got lost, a shit ton uh, buried he somewhere. Like hide, hide it away. No, yeah, he doesn't even use no banks, way. really. I'm not leaving until I get my picture on this throne. Yeah, he's got, like, not only money, dude, but he's got, like, gold and, like... I'll bury my wealth in the dirt. Hit that Crazy over there? fucking things that are, like, super expensive buried somewhere. You gotta hold my money. Hell, he'll probably take that with him to his Long. grave, bro. Damn. Give it all to my cousin Chelsea, who's just Thanks, fucking man. stupid. <sighs> it's like his favorite grand, you know, kid. Trash. Grand kid, yeah. He's one of those guys. I feel like he has like favorites and shit. Yeah. Cause we didn't really stick around. We left when we were younger, so whatever. Yeah. Can't fly on your grandparents, there, son. <laughs> So what do you want, Sophie? Why are you looking at me like that? What you want? You want one of those treats in there? You think you could deserve one? What about you, Whisk? Whiskey does this like funny, cute little thing where she'll kind of like look at me and then she'll like do this little shaky like dance move or something huh. and then like walk towards me. It's like her way of like being in a good mood or something. I think it's really funny. You got a lot of personality. They both do. Is that right? All right, hold on. I'll be right back. No matter how much long speech and talk keeps us free, I'm issuing you a direct order not to engage in hostile interactions with the alien visitors. This is effective immediately. I will not have our future intergalactic negotiations ruined by rash action. The national budget is still recovering after the week long binge of horror and holocaust you raped upon Los Angeles 12 years ago. I won't see this opportunity for peace squandered. I know you don't like this, Duke, but we can't go in with guns blazing just yet. 
feeling about this? Equinox, that coin game or something? Um, Duke Forever. Yeah, Duke Forever. It's fucking crazy you guys play that shit, man. Probably gonna hop on some X-Link with some boys here in a little bit. Some guys are talking about downloading Unreal Tournament or Unreal Championship or something. Where did Sick Killer go? Did he have to go? I guess he probably went to work or something. Yeah, yeah I saw him on his phone walking earlier. He's probably at work. Oh. I gotta do three hours. Hard labor. Duke's on the ball. Three hours hard oh. labor. Look at Chris Rock, dude. Oh. Bounce it, Bobby, dude. Can we go see Boo Sack Day? I don't know about this. <laughs> But you don't talk about my mother that way. That's what Hank said to him. You don't know her. She's 155 pounds. <laughs> he was like playing with that. Every time your mom, your mama's so fat. Every time she jumps, she gets stuck. You know. Like oh said, God. So fucking funny. That is hilarious. Though, I was watching it? it like, fucking two weeks ago. I got every episode. Hi, Dad. <sighs> Fucking hungry. Uh, uh, I start sighing a lot when I'm hungry. Jake's always like, what's wrong, bud? Get crunched up in the Fortnite? No, I'm just starving. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Getting crunched up on that Fortnite, brother. Should've played a better game. There's this new tournament mode, and it doesn't end after four hours. You stack your points, and I'm fucking. I already got 23 points to I'm rippling people. Get rippled. Get repelled. Rapel. Yeah. Max repel. I was like talking shit on some, like, like, MMA video to some other, like, fans that were talking shit or something about somebody. And I just, I remember I called some guy Bellator material. Uh, like, yeah, that guy's just Bellator insult. material. Sometimes I get, I'll talk mad shit and other people like, like my shit. It's so funny. And I get people like cussing me the fuck out and stuff. I love it, man. On Twitch? No, on, on no, hell no. On, on oh, YouTube. YouTube. Just commenting on like those, you know, those MMA videos oh, where like yeah, they yeah. talk shit about people like. Oh, okay, yeah. Like, for instance, Michael Johnson. <laughs> Getting knocked out, everybody hated him. You know, like everybody almost. There's a few guys that did, and they were like, "Man, I wish you would have done good." Like I'd go like leave them a comment. I'd just yeah. say like, "Why?" <laughs> you know, like <laughs> then they would like answer, and I'd be like, "Dude, he sucks. He's he's Bellator oh, material." No, it's time to kick yeah. some ass. And then other like five people, because everybody hates him, like like my shit, and this other guy's just like, well, "Fuck you." <laughs> yeah, I love talking shit on YouTube. So awesome. Yeah, me too. Uh, people just go try to go flood my shit with like dislikes and shit too. It's so fun. When you know you won, dude. They're doing that shit. You've got a lot of guts. Let's see what they look like. Like that other guy that tried to start that other excellent group that like feuded with the guys I've been playing with. He only had like me and one other person in his 
server, so I left because they shit ain't popping. Nobody in there, you know. As soon as I left the server, dude, I just started getting all these dislikes on my video. I just like, no, it's that guy. Huh. The videos are me playing with the friend that he used to be friends with that he like hates now and shit. So it's like, the guy's like super jealous of that dude or something. I don't know. It's so weird, man. They like brought me into that group and then they just start feuding with each other. I'm like, what the fuck's even going on here, man? I just got in here. I don't even know you guys. Warning. Hostiles ahead. Please hey, thanks. I might actually hop on Apex here in a little while. Mm. I think it'd be cool if that dude from Craigslist like actually like joined the fucking server, man. I think that would be cool. He's a pretty fucking normal dude. It really took me by surprise that because nobody even hit me up about it, you know, I was like, man, nobody wants this thing. A week later, I actually had it at 60 bucks, two days went by, and I was like, alright, maybe I'll start getting some, some replies here if I just lower it down to like 45. So it worked. Hey, this guy here named Man, the man with the damn plan, he's pretty cool. I host him, he straight up just streams Dreamcast. Like nothing but Dreamcast. I think he does like Saturn as well, but Sit hardcore. Down and shut up. And he I'll i I'll catch him like in my streams sometimes like lurking and shit. I don't even know if anybody hosts me anymore. Snipper me and Kimbers used to host me. He had the world record for uh Wizards and Warriors at one point. He's got it. There's more where that came from. Shoddy, Medkit, Slur, uh, Chug Jug, Minis. <laughs> Sorry, he was about Antonio's skill, so I'm not gonna brag too much. Man. What? What? No, Antonio's trash. <clears throat> Okay. He's tryharding with one of his friends. Stop playing with me because his friend wanted to play this mode, duos, arena. It's called. Yeah. What? What? Turned out to be adopted. Okay. What? Stuff in the kitchen? Oh, okay. Red stuff and shit, bro. Why don't you cut me a key to the house, lady? <laughs> Fuck, it's a lot of trash. Yeah. 
Thinking about getting mixer, man, and just trying that. Mixer. Brother was like telling me that he could tell me how much he does. He doesn't really play yeah, games like we do. Mixer. Tell you what, man. You drink that shit pre <coughs> workout, it like I makes watch. your stomach, your food digest like super fast. It feels like you didn't even eat anything. I feel like I gotta eat. I don't know. Maybe it like makes my metabolism like super cracked out or something. Earlier, I had like two fucking big riddles, man. Like, but are you exercising that. though when you do it? When you yeah. drink it? Yeah, because just exercising itself will. Yeah, that's true. That's probably what it is. I'm just pieces. burning the fat or burning all the food off. Yeah, you just, yeah, you get an appetite. That's, yeah, you're right. That's all it is. I'm just a big boy now and I need to eat. Mm -hmm. Like what? Yeah, that's how the rednecks say it. Speaking of working out, I'm gonna do a few more curls, why not? with you anytime. Hey, oh, are you like a toy or something? Come to life? Oh, you're pretty cool. I'm not a toy, kid. I'm an action figure. So tiny. What the hell? I know right where I'd stick him. Sweet. It's always the guy that it kills really me the room that I kill. But we're right Gets inside my RC end. car. You wanna use it? I already want the t-shirt. Everything. Turbo boost.
glitchy. Ah, spit. Bleeding, pussy. <laughs> what are you doing? You at work? Yeah, bug. Punch break. Big. Big. Yo, yeah, did you know that um, Sit Killer's foot is like smaller than the Xbox controller? That what? Soda? What, that soda? Always bet on dude. Yeah, this leaves like a nasty, like weird aftertaste for me. I mean, also to do this kind of, but the way that diet tastes, it's just got this weird fucking. I don't even know how to explain it, man. Yeah, it's the diet taste for sure, but. I mean, also to does it kind of, but real soda, man. You know, at least you get the sweet taste and not some like. Menthol. It's like a menthol drink or something, dude. I don't even understand. Nah, it's That's got more fizz in it. Call it. I like the dye sodas. I like the dye sodas, sodas better. Ugh. Yeah, it's, just, it's Ugh. got more fizz in it. I got one right here. I got I got dye A and W root beer right here. Yeah. Oh my god! Well, that's better than diet coke or something like that. That shit just regular coke and all that. It's just too syrupy, dude. It's just too much yeah, syrup. In I agree. It. That's why I don't even drink it anymore. Man. Yeah, I can't drink that shit anymore. Or if I do, I just take like a few sips and I just throw the rest of it away because it just sucks after you just. After you open it, after like five minutes, it, the fizz is gone and shit. Yeah. You know? So. I just, I don't know, man. I just can't handle diet. It just tastes like shit for me. Yeah, it tastes different, but. The, the, uh, the carbonation, though, I do like that. That helps, like, digest food and shit. Well, then you should only drink it when you, when you have trouble digesting food. I just work out, so it helps better than that shit. Hell no, I can't. If you ever have indigestion, bro, start doing sit-ups, man. <laughs> It'll fucking clear everything right up. That's what I do. I don't even really like sit down and do them either. I'll just kind of like raise up and down, raise up and down, and eventually like it'll just like just do it. Yeah, I do crunchers. Yeah, but I would feel kind of nasty. Yeah, if you're eating like a shit ton. You, ha uh, you have to let it somewhat digest. You can't just do sit-ups as soon as you d get done oh, eating. No, that's not what I'm saying. saying. Yeah, that's why I would wait like that. Definitely, yeah. If you wait like 30 minutes in a or an hour, 45 minutes, and you you're having like, like problems and you feel like you're burping, you're going to burp it up, and you really don't burp it up, but you could like feel it coming, that's what I'm saying. That's when I start doing the crunches and the, just the little piss sit-ups or even just lift weights or something. And if you just keep... If you just start doing shit, it'll just, it'll digest. That's basically what you're probably telling. If you have indigestion, it means you're probably fucking not getting enough exercise, man. Listen, you can find a way like he's trying to like grab your food or something. Yeah, fuck that. If you want some motherfucker, you put your hand out and I give you some. Without saying shit, without saying even, oh, can I have some? No, he just fucking puts his hand inside the bag. No. No. Can't. Once you do that shit, dude, if you put your hand in my fucking chips without my permission, dude. <laughs> yeah, that dude's probably handling his PP I and all that shit. Your ass, dude. <laughs> I'll beat your fucking ass. I know where the fuck your hand been at. Yeah, like in general, if somebody ever does that, yeah, that's how you get really fucked up, man. Like, <laughs> Yeah, well, that, that double dip or doing any of that shit in jail, like, heard, like, stories of people making, like, shit out of commissary, like, making some kind of homemade dip or something and sharing it with everybody in the fucking pod or something. And one guy double dips, they all, like, fuck the dude, the dude gets fucked up, you know? Unless it's, like, some hardcore guy that just will beat everybody's ass or something. 
Someone who uh, walks walks into their own shit, man. Someone who shits where they sleep. Jamin's funny. He hit me up the other day or something. Hey, glitchy so I went to go sell sell one of my N64s today. And uh this guy on Craigslist. This guy tells me he's gonna pull up in a black Honda. And so I'm waiting. This crackhead guy pulls up beside me in a black Honda. I get out because I think it's the dude. He gets out of his car, he walks up to me. I got this bag. 64 in it. This guy's a strap crackhead, dude. I'm like, yo, where's the money? And he kind of like peeks into the bag, he like looks down in there, and he's like, I don't have any money. He's like, I was gonna ask you some money. I was like, I was like, you're the guy from Craigslist, right? And he's like, no, no, no. And I was like, oh, okay, well, whatever. I don't have any money. And then he's gonna ask me some other shit. And I was like, I don't have that. I don't have. I don't have anything. So like, before that guy even showed up. This guy in the same exact vehicle as the dude I'm supposed to meet was parked right in front of me, dude, but it was like a newer model. And it was like this older dude with his wife, like they were like having some conversation. But after the crackhead guy was like bombing money for me, I went up to the other guy, because I thought it was the dude, and I was like, I like walked over to him, had the bag, and I like raised it up. He like looked over at me, his windows rolled up. But I was like, the bag, and he was just like, he looked at me and like waved me off, and then he drove off. Because he thought I was bombing money or trying to sell him drugs or some weird shit. So yeah, dude, I had some like weird shit happen, man. I got some crackhead bombing money from me. They were all driving. They were all driving a Honda, a black Honda. Every one of them. They all had black Hondas. And then the guy actually showed up. And I was like, yo, dude. I was like all nervous because of what just happened. I was like, yeah, man, he's. Weird shit just happened. I had some crackhead guy over there asking me for money, and then some other old guy I thought was you, like, waved me off, but I was trying to sell him drugs, and then here you are. And he was like, he probably like thought I was gonna rip him off, because I was like acting all sketched out, and I was just, like, I'm just kinda shook it up, man. <laughs> some crackhead guy, and all that shit happened. I was just like, yeah, but here's your shit, and like, I was telling him about the and stuff. Who wants white meat, huh? Seeing if I can get him in it? here. If he, if he ever joins, the guy, he'll like, I'll probably like laugh about it. I was thinking about getting on the Discord call when I was like right there when the crackhead guy pulled up. I was like, shit, maybe, maybe I should get on the call and like show these guys like this dude right here and shit. But the funniest part was when the crackhead guy like peeked into the bag to look what it was. <laughs> Cause I like walked up to him with a bag and he didn't even know what the fuck, but I thought it was a dude, you know? I was like, show this crackhead guy. I'm like, yo, dude, what's up? Like he like nodded at me before he got out of the car. I like thought it was him and everything. It was so funny. I thought it was like the dude. That whole scenario just sounds so crazy. It was, dude. And the craziest part was they were all driving a black haunt. Everybody had a black haunt. All three of them. All three of them had But the the old dude had the same exact model, but it was like not the same exact model, but it was like a newer model of the one that he had, basically. So I really thought it was him, dude. Oh. And then he like waved me off. I thought I like pissed him off for like making him wait there too long or something. I was like, maybe that's him. He like walked up. And his wife like pointed at me and then he looked, looked over and I was like raising this bag up, like pointing at the bag, like is this is this for you? Like he, he thought that I was like trying to sell him drugs or something. Like some Steve moment in Walmart parking lot, bro. <laughs> That's what it sounds like, bro. <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha.
It was fucking hilarious. I felt like one of those That's pranksters so on YouTube. Dude, I, recorded that, dude. I, I know, man. I was just thinking about it. I just. That has like the pocket shit bro like that and I would have had like the back of the phone with the camera going up like that and put it in my pocket. And just yeah, like man. keep it there and shit. <laughs> and so like, so it, like, it was just so fucking weird dude. Wow. I can't believe that even happened. Like I wanted to avoid anything like that. I always avoid situations like that but it just was gonna happen either way you know. This is what happens when you go to Walmart dude. Especially on the good side yeah, of town. Dude, That's where they go with bum like, money and shit. It's like the first few times when I get bugged, dude, and then like I would see like cops and shit, and like they would point to me and shit. I'm like, you talking to me? They're like, no, 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 behind you. I'm like, oh, shit. And I had the bird on me too, bro. I was like, oh shit. And, like, yeah, that's always a shitty feeling. Dude, yeah, dude. I, bro, that had to come already like three times. Three times, and I didn't get caught. I might drink some wine later tonight. Uh, I'm done smoking though, man. I just like, want to do it. I'm from Las Vegas, and I say nice. kill them all. Yeah, I got till Monday. Yeah, pretty much. The cool thing is, Gabe and my dad already have a frame of the place built, so. Dope. Yeah, I'm gonna try to for the most part. I mean, I'll have to come back and visit sometime. Help her out a little bit here and there, so. Yeah, I mean, my brother still lives here in Knoxville, so he can come over here. I'll take her to the doctor or whatever. I know, right? Well, I get to build my own house, more like it. Just fuck for me. I want one of those old-time fucking ovens, dude, where you could like a, a, a stove where you could fucking cook one. No, it's like one of those old redneck ones where you could just fucking cook on it and shit. You know what I mean? Like a like a heater or whatever. I don't even know how what you would call it. A lot of the old school rednecks have, I probably won't be able to get one in there, but I still want to do that, man. I think that would be cool. Want shit, get a bunch of pelts and shit, like, kill a fucking coyotes or something, man, skin them. Have some dope ass, like, carpet, bear rug or something. Yeah, I was just watching that whole company. That redneck guy killed a lot. Oh, yeah, he my goal is to kill a copperhead and cook it, dude, and, like, film it, man, and stick it on YouTube. Like, I want to do that, man. Well, hey, I mean, at least you're going to get some stuff. Yeah, and there's copperheads all over that place, dude. You'll be able to do that shit more often, you know? Probably more, even more often than skate. <sighs> Definitely, dude. I don't even skate anymore, really, man, honestly. It's just not really as fun as it once was. I mean... I mean, Times change. Of you. Yeah, I'll always like love it, and I'll always kind of do it here and there. But I'm just not. I mean, let's face it, dude. There's no future in it for me. I can't chuck myself off of shit that's the height of a building. I mean, my knee is already kind of fucked up. You know. I could do like super technical skating, maybe. I mean, that's probably like all I could do. But yeah, I mean, my dad's got a cement mixer up there. I was gonna fucking get some bags of cement, man, and like lay out like a big fucking flat spot about the size of like a garage or something. Just put like a grind box on it somewhere and just skate on that. <laughs> Make my own little fucking skate park. Yeah, I got like fucking 200 acres up there, dude. Yeah. You probably have more open space too in your house. Well, the house that we're building is not going to be that big, but the cool thing is you could always build onto it. It's just like a cabin, basically. Which is funny. Yeah, I know, oh. yeah, that's what I'm thinking about doing. Just digging out the basement and just laying some concrete down there, make a foundation. Yeah, I would do that. You know, try to make it look roomy. I'm not saying you have to, but I'm saying like... 
but a basement. Dude, if I get a basement, dude, I'm gonna build, I'm gonna have like, I get some arcade machines down in there and make that the fucking game room because, dude, the basements are always like the coldest parts of the house. You know what I mean? Like, my dad's got another house down there. It's like all fucked up and shit. He's gonna like tear it down and like do, you know, build it all back and stuff. But it's got the foundation. But it's got the basement down there, dude. Down where the basement is, dude. It's like natural AC, you know, without AC. No, I ain't gonna do that. That's for online, brother. That's too much. But I mean, on one of the arcade machines, I've already got like a. I've already made a marquee, like a ROMs marquee for one of the machines I'm gonna make. I just gotta like, put it out. Dude, I wanna start making like kiosks for my games. Cause I was like looking around, I saw like a dope ass Xbox original kiosk that some guy like on Twitter like showed. And I just like remember seeing those in the GameStops back in the day, you know? Playing on them and shit. I always thought they were cool. They're not really that hard to make. I mean, you just gotta get like the LEDs and you know, just measure it up. A uh. radio. Yeah, I'm just like trying to get everybody to get Skype again. I'm not doing that, dude. Yeah, Alright, well, he he's saying that. that he can't get Discord to work Ooh. on his shit, Venom, <laughs> that one call. Yeah, he's like, fuck twat cord, as it won't open on laptop, load of shit, hit me up on Skype or don't, up to you guys. Whatever, what are you talking about? He has to fucking find out. He just, he just uses 32-bit computers and shit. It's like I told him the other day, I, he was like complaining about how all the shit on the computer like doesn't work for him. Like, well, dude, you have to put the money in to get it. You can't be buying used, old-ass computers that are used on eBay. Like, it just don't work. I don't know, man. Well, what it is, he just doesn't make any money. He can't go buy it because he's like always broke. And I guess I get that. But, you know, go get some money, man. Number one, get a fucking job. Yeah. But I guess he gets that government money, and I guess I don't know what is why he's even getting it. I don't it's think peanuts, he, like, really... though. Like I don't understand. Yeah, like, no, exactly. people, like, he, people he act like they won the lottery when they get this shit. It's like, yeah, yeah but you have no fucking life. He doesn't you even no... get anything. Yeah, yeah I'll get I'd rather exactly. get a job. So, like, but even just for three weeks, I told him just get a job for three weeks, dude. And it's like, yeah, why, why doesn't he do it? Does he like create? Does he? Is it like for being? Like mentally off or something? Like I don't even know why know, he even gets it in the first know. place. Dude. Yeah, I don't know, but dude. What, you have to you say some really you? nutty yeah. shit, I think, when to get the that. Last time you ever no. the fuck? That's not how you do that shit. Yeah. Oh, a lot of people play you stuff, but the shit that he picks is just not. No, dude, it's like the worst thing you could get, and he like, I don't know why he thinks it's good. Like he was talking about some $25 graphics card one day. Like, dude, what the fuck are you ever gonna be able to play with that? Stuff. I know. And I just, like I said, I straight up told him, like, yo, man, you buying these like shitty ass computers off eBay for like nothing, dude? Like, I mean, what do you expect? You gotta save the money, or you gotta really, you gotta have to fork it in. And I get the fact that he doesn't. He spent so much money on Xbox. That's what it is. That's why he doesn't want to get off it. Which I guess I, I understand that, but he's put a lot of money into the Xbox shit. I get that. That's yeah, like eight thousand dollars in the past four years. So he's but only that, put in two him, grand for him, a year. For him, that's like a million dollars, though. He ain't ever gonna get that shit up, bro. He has to, bro. He has to. You gotta overcome that shit. You gotta overcome that shit.
even think he cares about that though. Yeah, that's the thing. He don't care. That's cool. That's that's what he likes. And besides, and besides he said himself. He says, "Oh no, Xbox is better than PC." Well, sometimes he'll say like the opposite. It's just however he feels at the moment. If he's like in a bad mood, like, he'll just shit all over PC or whatever he can't use. You know, but I've heard him say like other times, like I know PC's better, but I've put all my money into this, and work. I can never get anything working on PC. Down, and I'm just Duke. like, dude, it's because you have a five dollar computer, you man. Like, didn't make it. <laughs> that's why. Exactly. That and but like, and he knows that, but was wrong. he just says, Dead you know, wrong. I just can't afford Hope the good God, computer and shit. Misleading us. If there's nothing, well, but he's so into video games, right? So why not? It's, exactly. you, just, you just work for like two weeks, they get a five hundred dollar computer, yeah. and then they no, no, they quit, and then you can go back to playing video games. They quit. Yeah. The same with Otaku because he gets government <laughs> checks, so it's like collect the government checks while working, and then you make. There you go. You got money. While working, man, that's the fucking way to go. You know, just for a couple shit. weeks, though. Like if you can't function in society for two weeks, I don't understand that. You understand. I don't know. I mean, what they, do you guys they, think they seem kind of normal. Like that. Do you think it's just it because like he just doesn't want to do it, or? But yeah, but nothing. There's nothing more important than video games them, to him, right? I mean, that's all. He even says like that's what he does. And the same with me too. Like I want to hang out and play video games. But if I don't, I'm gonna go do whatever I can to get the money so I can do that. You know, to do shit I want to do. So, and when it, when the requirement is only like two weeks of working. I don't That's understand it. why you can't do that. Like, for me, it's, you know, getting the Corvette and stuff like that, which takes, you know, a year or more at the time. Of why do you think he's like that? And that's what, what I did, though. I, I didn't care what I had to do. Him is? What do you I get, think the problem with him is? Dude, why I guess, does he like that? I guess there's just some kind of roadblock where it's just he can't do it. Just, like, I don't know. Do you think he's just too moody? Like, if he goes out there and does the work, some, he just finds some ya. reason to kind of, like, get pissed off or something. Just uh, I, I don't know, because I, I don't understand I that, but... Um, but the I same with Nataku, too, I can't like... can't think what, of anything, man. I just, how hard is it just to sit there and, like, be a cashier for... Like old time. Uh, two <laughs> yeah. weeks out of your life, you know? And then you can go back back to playing games, though. But he's going to sit there with, you know, a computer that keeps crashing. Like, I, I don't know. <laughs> I just don't understand that. Man, hey, fuck this, mate. I'm done with it. Power yeah. Is for pussies. That's why I don't like PC. Xbox is better. Like one time in the ROM server, he like started saying that shit, and I kicked him out. And then like he like asked me, he's like, "Yo, add me back in there." And I was just like, "Well, no, dude, because you just start trashing on everything on here. So, you know, what's the point, right? You're not gonna play any of this shit." 360. You could say 360 was better because those days were awesome. Like, I, I guess, like, in, even, I, I don't even think this music is that big stuff, man. Obviously, it does suck, man. Nobody fucking plays it, but back then it was cool, you know? I don't understand, but... There's just so much shit on here, you can do everything, it's... I just don't understand, like you said, like, why not just go somewhere for fucking two weeks, man? And just buy the thing and just quit. That's what you really want to do. Yeah, and then you get to do what you want to do. But the thing is, he had a job, that time he had a job, he didn't fucking play video games, man. I think he was like into like speed or something like really bad. Like he was like addicted or something. I feel like that's what was happening. Because I mean obviously he was working. Either that or he was just straight up lying about that. I'm gonna get some pizza though. Here, Step right up and get some.
I need to go update graves on this shit. Duke Nukem Forever is trash. We're trash. You get teased. You fun rise spot? I don't know what to do on that. What's up, sick killer? Dude, that's why I refunded that game, because it sucks. What game? Rust. Nah, dude, it got 200,000 reviews. Good reviews, dude. So Two. what? You can't. If you don't spawn at the same point and you can't find each other, then what's the fucking point? Well, maybe there is a way to do it though. That way. Otherwise, how could it get good? How could it get good reviews? Yeah, but your dick is hanging out and shit. I don't want to see that shit. That's trash. Yeah, that's that's bullshit. You got your guy's dick is bigger than my guy's dick. <laughs> what kind of shit is that? I can't be a girl. Why does it have to be a guy? That yeah, I want to be. I like being the girl characters. Understand. Yeah. yeah. Why can't I be a naked girl? Oh, you can. But I guess it chooses for you. How? That's trash. It chooses for you. That's what's trash. That's bullshit. Yeah. Remember I found that girl and I just... Yeah, yeah. That's how I know you can play as a girl. I mean, if there was... Yeah, what? How the hell? I found a dead body just lying there. It's crazy. Well, no. It was... It was remember? Like you said, it was... It was real... It's real time. So my guy is probably there and he's probably dead right now. Yeah. It's just like how you said. So... If you're not on there, you guys probably did. Yeah, yeah. I, I know. I don't know what to do. I, so, I try. I kind of hid my guy. I went up on one of the towers before I quit the game. I, I went up in one of the towers. Because it takes like an hour to load. What about Red Dead Redemption? Yeah, it's just Grand Theft Auto, right? But it's like Western. I'll try yeah, it. Well, I'll try it. I mean, I guess that's different, right? I'll try that. Is it on Steam? Yeah, it has to be, right? Okay, Grand Theft Auto is, so... Yeah, I gotta be. You know what game? Uh, Red Dead Redemption? The new one? I played it. Is it good? Yeah, I mean, yeah, you got... would think someone like me would like love that kind of game, but honestly, I just didn't care for it. Yeah, that's probably how I would do it too. Yeah, because you just copy how I how everything I do, right? No, <laughs> everything costs money. How I think, yeah, like, you're just a fucking money. carbon copy. Well, maybe it's better on like multiplayer. Even... It's it's third person. I I don't really care about the third person. It's better though than first person, isn't it? Right. At the end of the day, there's still a center on the screen where you aim. I mean, it's not really that much different, is it? To me, I don't know. Except on... The way that you're aiming. Yeah, yeah, you can hide behind Listen, walls. if you think how I just told you... You can see you around corners. Yeah, yeah, that. That's about the only thing that's different. You, it's a wider view, so it is kind of better. You just have to learn how to adapt to it if you don't play like that. Like Grand Theft Auto, I can play that. That's fine. It, that's always been third person, but... But it's the same thing, though, right? I, yeah. I, I just think I just don't want to pay money for it. That's all. How much is it? Probably like sixty bucks. Damn! Didn't it come out a while ago? Uh huh. It should be like twenty dollars now. But the thing is, they just released like online for it like a month or two ago or oh, something God. like that. Oh, I think. Shit. Yeah, when I get paid, I'm gonna get spooked. <laughs> It's like, I don't know, man, I just don't really, I don't know why I don't think they play it on a video game. I don't know. I played it at my brother's house, so I got, I know what it's like. Not online, but just single player. It's the funny how the KKK is on like, it. I don't even 
something else that's on screen. It might be on something else. Like EA or something. Nah, not EA. I don't know. It's Rockstar, right? So it might be on screen. Uh, yeah, something like that. This is like a Western Grand Theft Auto. Yeah, exactly. I don't it's alright. Yeah, I don't see how it could be bad, but... Uh, um, not, I wouldn't say it's bad, but... Yeah. I just didn't really care for it too much. I probably wouldn't buy it. <sighs> Fist fighting and bar fighting is pretty cool. And then you could rob the trains and shit. And it is like GTA when you rob somebody or do a crime, and it's like the radar pops up and shit. Really? Yeah. What the cop horses come? Yeah. Sure. <laughs> dude, that would be funny. Dude. That's pretty cool. You guys would like it, I think. That would be funny. Awesome. Once I start working and shit, I'd probably actually just buy it just to fucking have it and play with you guys if you guys get it. Yeah. I'll get it eventually Heck if you guys not. get it. Oh, you're playing Deep forever? Play Deep 3D. No, it's not. It's not on Steam. What the hell? Are you out of work now or what? Yeah. How long did you work today? Is it two hours? Right in the jewel. Yeah, two hours. Damn. You should try to get more hours, dude, so you can get more shit. Yeah. Yep. You're on the short bus now? I'll talk to you guys later. No, it's just a van for West Side. Uh, short van? Duke! Later. Up here! Holy shit, what a fucking mess! The president is gonna fucking shit his pants when he sees this! I've gotta head out to the dam! You need to get to the fucking Duke Dome!